Welcome to part number 32 of Need for Speed Underground 2. This is the Moving Chicane, and today we're doing more events here in stage number 4. So... Hey, your ride needs to run smarter with all its new parts, so upgrade your computer to op... Okay, before Rachel rudely interrupted me, um, I was gonna say, as you guys saw in the previous segment, we unlocked, uh, stage 3 ECU. And because of the fast loading times in this game, because of the PC version, I figured... Might as well start off the segment by buying all the parts, so that's why you're seeing me quickly go through all this. Okay, so that's all the parts purchased. Let's go ahead and move on. Hmm, what should we do next? That's a really good question. What should we do next? Well, there's a street cross race there. I don't know why I went around it, but whatever. <laughs> Okay, that nearly started in disaster. Alright, so the Eclipse, that's going to be a tough car to fight. Oh, well, he hit the wall or something because I closed the gap by a huge amount. Alright, here's my chance. Dump him. There we go. Dumped him. That's more of a bump and run than anything. Retaliation fails on his end. And now we can smoothly sail to an easy victory. Damn, everyone's hitting the wall. Easy. Eh, it wasn't nearly easy. So I won't do any URLs in this segment. I will do, however, some special events. There's a side race nearby, so we might as well do that right now. Okay, it's kind of annoying how the cursor keeps coming up. Man, that golf is disgusting. With that freaking squiggly spoiler. Damn! Three cars involved in that accident. It's kind of annoying how the cursor keeps coming up. I'm not even moving the mouse or anything. Okay, so inside line is good here. This exit isn't that tight. It's essentially a hairpin. So cutting through the alley where the Anarchist store is for performance. Oh boy, here we go. Water fountain time. Now is it going to be smooth or... Oh, it is. There's an easy opening. Right there, yep. We're good.
So yeah, this is another long circuit race. Well, this race has been really easy so far and kind of boring. <laughs> I won't lie. It is kind of boring. Let's see if the AI cars can start rubber banding like crazy. That's a word I'm going to start using a lot, isn't it? Rubber band, rubber band. Rubber banding this, rubber band that. Oh yeah. Everything I everything around my life revolves around rubber banding. I pick up all the ladies talking about my rubber banding. That was a bad joke, I know. That's all you can do when when this race has been really boring. Or sabotage our own performance because we're stupid. <laughs> You know what I think is making this race so easy? The, uh, the fountain area. Because we're able to cut right through it while the AI cars actually have to go around the fountain. I think that's what's causing this race to be really easy for us. A little bit of a crash victory. Really? Only a hundred points? What a ripoff. Carbon hoods! Cool! Okay, let's check out that special event down the street. So I smacked the hell out of the car because I got a text message, I wanted to see who it was from, and yeah, I didn't pay attention. Coal Harbor, all right. Yeah, exactly. But at the same time, I thought maybe a four second vic margin of victory would be maybe enough for at least 200, but no, I mean, I still don't kind of understand the whole um, rep points thing because I don't know, I feel like some of the finishes, like, it's, it's kind of inconsistent. I don't know. Maybe it's different for every mode, but sometimes I feel like I won by over 5 seconds and I get 300. Sometimes I feel like I won by over 2 seconds and got nothing. It really doesn't matter, to be honest, because with this whole um, incomplete race glitch, we have to do the first sponsor we get anyways. That way it gives us the most money for every sponsor win. And in the long run, gives us the most money in general. And I don't know what they see in you, but you made Elabor's cover. Well, they see a lot in me, Rachel.
<laughs> I like the RX-8 on the bottom too. That's cool. Oh, look at that. How in no, I would say inconvenient. How convenient. Two events, a drift and a street cross right around the corner. Awesome. Another really long, squiggly drift event. Here we go. So the cell can put me in the wall. I didn't lose my points, but I lost my multiplier. Hey, welcome back, her. Oh, I think you said I come. I think you said I, I come back. Sorry. I just quickly glanced. It said I come B, so I think you meant my back. Awesome. All right. 154K. Definitely a 300 point victory right there. Ooh, new headlight colors. Awesome. That will be helpful. Might as well buy it right now. I mean, the shop's right around the corner. Actually, no, we're not buying any headlights just yet. Because in stage 5, I actually might get rid of the flames. I might. So for those who want to celebrate because the flames are so ugly in this car, don't celebrate just yet. Because we could just ruin the 240 even more. We don't know yet. So I'm going to wait until stage 5. I was really trying to hit the apex, but instead of hit the wall. Although, no harm, no foul. Still have our lead. One second. It's not bad.
So one more lap. Damn, we increased the gap to four seconds. What happened back there? They might have took each other out. Awesome. Dominate, easy win. Yes, new exhaust tips and stuff magazine cover opportunity. Okay. Stuff magazine. Have you heard of it? Nope. They're taking stills of everything around. Score big and the front sheet is yours. Awesome. All right. Sounds like a deal, Rachel. Um. Let's see here. Okay, that's a time trial, which I'm not in the mood to do right now. Instead, we'll do the drag race. At the airport. Okay, we'll, we'll use a 240. Man, the previous attempt was so close. This is my eighth attempt at this race. If we don't win this in 10 tries with the 240, we're switching to the Supra. Oh, we just edged out the RX-7. Yes! I don't care about the rep points for that race. Screw it. Ooh, there's another street cross up ahead. Cool. And another drag race, which for the drag race, we'll switch to the Supra. And here we go. Wow, this is a really aggressive start by everybody. Okay, I barely led the first lap, at least. Oh, come on. Don't do this to me, please. Shit, we have a big deficit now to the 350Z. Okay, I feel like we're closing the gap to the 350, but at the same time, it's like, it's so far away. Yeah, he had nothing to do with that first incident, but yeah, I, I put him in the wall because I don't care. <laughs> so I'm trying to win this race, damn it. And there we go. Damn, that was a pretty long street cross race. No lie. Okay, let me go ahead and make a thumbnail for this race.
and video, and let's continue. Nice, new roof scoops. Okay, so this is the time trial. Okay, we have to go all the way to Beacon Hill? Holy crap. It's kind of far, but hey, we can do some events up there too. So it's not like it's the end of the world or anything. Okay, it's right. Okay, it's not that far then. I have a lot of time to spare. You made it. Spoiler is featuring your run and putting your wheels on their cover. Nice. Okay, I accidentally hit A too fast. Okay, what's next? Not in the mood to do a circuit race right now, so let's do a drag race instead. Oh wow, the A3 has more acceleration, so we'll switch to the A3 then. The A3 will not be the superior car by the end of the game, it's going to be the Super and the 240. Okay, fourth attempt of this race. Everyone died in the previous attempt, except for the winner. The previous race was just batshit insane. Oh my god, I can't see anything. I can't see shit. Wow, dude. Oh my god. The Sentra died. Wow, man. Oh, no worries, man. We, we have a lot of people from a lot of different parts of the world. It's all good, dude. Alright, you know what? That could be a thumbnail when the other car crashes into the traffic. So, let me check real quick. I'll be right back. Nope, not, not a good shot, unfortunately. Doesn't matter, we have a thumbnail anyways. It would have been cool to say like, hey look! Here's a clickbaity video because I have a car that's fucking crashing and stuff. But it don't matter. It's not important. What's important is the next event, which is circuit racing. And I completely missed that whole... Okay. This race, not bad. This will most likely require a race restart. Dude, that truck straight turned into me. Oh, come on, dude. Okay, you guys saw what happened. That truck just completely turned into me. That was lame. Yeah, so I crashed at the, on the final lap after dominating the race. But I was catching up to the, the new first place guy, but unfortunately the truck turned into me. So 
We're doing all we can to get the nitrous back. We have a full can of nitrous. Ready for any emergency situations like we had last time. Hopefully we don't have to have an emergency to use it. Oh, there's plenty of traffic. I mean, like, it won't hurt to use some of it. Yeah, see, we gain it all back. <laughs> Pretty much, Gus. still second place after all that happening Th that's really strange <laughs> I'm not complaining but hey that's that's still pretty odd like I just flipped did a bunch of freaking somersaults and yet I'm still in second place I'm about to close the gap to the leader for a crazy ride right there. If this was the race in stage zero, then we would be screwed, but one more lap, that makes a difference here. Using my emergency camera just in case any traffic cars come out of a blind spot. Wow, that was really close. Holy shit. I started to feel the car snap a little bit. I think at this point in the race, it'll be safe to go on the other side. Okay, we're good. We won. Strange that there's no celebration on the freeway, but... Oh, well. Rims, cool. There's a nearby, yep, it's right ahead. So I think for this segment, we'll probably do the drag race and then that special event up there, if it's not a time trial. Well, if it is a time trial, we'll do it. But if it's not, then we'll do it right now. Yeah, this is a time trial. Okay. So yeah, we'll do the time trial and then end of the segment for this video. Wow. Wow, th this is really, really difficult. Finally! Finally, 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 finally! Oh man, this race took me like 16 attempts! 
Holy shit, man. Oh, I'm so glad it's all over. Oh, man. 16 attempts for that one race. What a crazy, crazy race. Seriously. Alright, one more thing I want to do in this segment. Which is the uh, photo shoot up there. Yeah, see, that race is all about luck, dude. So for the people who are watching on the stream, they pretty much saw it all. For those who are watching this as a video, yeah, just everything you can imagine on how you can lose the race. It, it, just, just use your imagination, basically. Yeah, it was close, Luis. I'm gonna have to do a lot of editing on the final cut of that video, dude. Seriously. Alright, so... Up the hill we go. Have a minute. I think we'll make it just fine with extra time to spare. Yeah, we're, we're fine. 45 seconds and we only have a couple of corners to go. Your run must have been good enough for the boys at Automax Magazine because you just made the cover. Let's see here, okay. What do I want to do? I want to have that little horse in the background, or whatever that is. Oh my god, that's that's disgusting, dude. Oh <laughs> jeez. Six hundred dollars. That's it. Ah, uh, rip off. I deserve more than that. Come on. That was a lot of effort. All right. So next time on NFS Underground Two, it's more events. There's really nothing else to say, really.